guys, what's up? It's your boy, so back on another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. Today's video is going to be us completing the Hybrid League and Nations SBC Advanced SBC group. So without further ado, I suggest we get right into the video. Right then guys, welcome back to the video and this is the Puzzle Master SBC. Like I said, I always get my recipes of foot bin, so this is the one I opted for because I had Ericsson in the club, so it saved me a couple K from getting him. But apart from that, I bought everyone else off the market. There's only a couple of expensive players, if I'm honest. I think was no, he was he was quite cheap. I'm trying to think he was quite expensive. I think it was Tecatito Corona. He was six grand. And there's one more if I 4700 Daily Blend. There you go. So you got Tecatito Corona and Daily Blend who were quite expensive. But apart from that, this SPC average is around like 12. 13 14k so yeah like I said you guys have had more than enough time to screenshot this by now 55k pack a board or a walkout would be insane from this can we get it that'd be nuts but let's get into the pack come on walk out or boards walk out or boards walk out or boards walk out rubinevs walk out it is come on Great way to start off this group. Great way to start off this group. Let's have a quick look at how expensive he is. Ooh! Ooh! Ruben Diaz, Jimenez, Saul, and Bellingham. I'm going to keep Bellingham in the club because I want to try him out. I want to do a play review on him. But I'm going to have a quick look on my phone at how expensive Ruben Diaz is as Nate's him. I'm not expecting him to be that expensive because he's only got 61 pace, but we're going to have a quick look. 13 grand. That's what I thought. Not too meta, but obviously a good card still. But I'll catch you guys back once we complete the next SBC. Right then, guys. One thing I didn't see before we get into the next SB SBC, actually, is that the back of the pack, we've actually got an Alexandro. So that was actually a really, 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 really good, really good 55k pack. Right then, guys. Welcome back to the video where we are now back. And we've got the Fiendish SBC completed, which is the second one out of the group. There's only one really expensive player in this SBC, and it was this guy, because there's only one of him on the market. Um, so yeah, I had to buy him, otherwise I wouldn't have been able to complete the SBC. But that's basically the SBC. If you guys want to screenshot it. There you go. Let's claim this mega pack. Again, boards or walkout would be great because, like I said, we did just spend 10k on one player, which is quite a bit. So, boards or walkout would be greatly appreciated here. Come on. What are you going to do, EA? What are you going to give us? So, boards. Ah, it's, yeah. It's not a good boards, though. It's really not a good boards, that one, unfortunately. But we got... Wow. Okay. Let's quickly check the duplicate items. Okay, so that's one board. Four boards in one pack. Actually, I'll take it back. That's quite a good pack then. Right then, guys. Welcome back to the penultimate SBC of this group called Advanced. This one was a bit pricey as well. Obviously, I used a footbin again for the example for it. But yes, I had to spend 6.8k on the Carrius and there was only two on the market. PC Mark is a bit more expensive than console, but it is what it is. Obviously, I'll let you guys screenshot it. Just for reference, this is probably on the right hand side. I know you can't really see it because of face cam, so now you know, but... There you go, enough time screenshot. Let's get into this pack. Premium gold players pack, I think that was. Yes, it was. I believe it was a 25k pack worth of players. So board or walkout would be great to make some coinage back for the last SBC. But let's see what we get. It's a boards. Portuguese center forward. Ciao, Felix. Let's go. We move. That's important. That's actually clutch. That's like 2.5k, I believe. And Paco Al Alcacea, I mean, I don't know about this guy, but uh, let's just move on. But yeah, I'll catch you guys back at the last SBC once we completed that. Right then, guys, welcome back to the last SBC of the group. And yes, we got it done. Again, a bit of a pricey one, but it is what it is. At the end of the day, League and Nation Hybrid isn't necessarily the cheapest one out of the three SBC groups to do. But like I said, we got it done and successfully. So this is the last group. Just so you guys know, on the right here is Mazapus. But yes, you got Mazapus and Kadarabic. So that's the group. We're going to submit it. Remix Players Pack, which is a 30k pack. And then what we also get is 13k guaranteed coins back for completing the group, as well as a nice kit, which we can use for our players in, for example, Rivals or Champs. So that's the kit. Again, a walkout. I'm going to keep that in the club and we're going to go over to the 30k pack and open that. Right again. Board or walkout would be insane out of this. It would actually be good because these this pack does have silvers in it. What can we get? It's a board. So I'll take it. It's Cramrich. I'll take it out of a 30k pack. It's not the best, but it's not the worst either. 
We get Bentancur, Konza. Some of these silvers might sell, might sell for a bit. But yeah, apart from that, hasn't necessarily been the most successful group that we've done. We started with a walkout and ended on the board. So it's not too bad. But if you guys have enjoyed this video and want to see more videos of me in the future, please let me know in the comments section down below. And leave a like and subscribe to this uh, YouTube channel. I'm not asking for a lot. It helps out at the end of the day. But yeah, like I said, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Peace.